Huh? Where the heck am I? Okay, Grubface, why did you wrap me here? Tell me! Uh, okay, but why now? Why not? Huh? It's that time of the year where many people don't celebrate this feast though. I was planning on a Valentine's video, but you guys didn't like the idea, so I did some Chinese Lunar New Year's instead. Update, it's Valentine's Day. This time we have 371 votes. Same thing, if I mentioned you, you're out of the game. And the two contestants with the highest votes stays on a roll. Santa Needle got 22 votes. <laughs> Maria Carey got 28 votes. Snowdy got 30 votes. Blood Rail kept her cool. And Ginger Tag got 44 votes. Coffee Nickel. Elsa and Pinebow. One of you will be out of the game. Okay, guys, I just showed you something. This is pretty cool. Get used to it, lol. Who will it be? Coffee Nickel is eliminated. Coffee Nickel with 68 votes, Elsa with 86, and Pinebook with 93. Honestly, this is cool. The votes were pretty close as ever, and I liked it. Okay, let's proceed. Okay, come on, just something this time. Are we going easy or are we going hard? Oh, you may like it or you may not like it. Now, you may be asking, why is the wheel all animal related? Well, I was supposed to post this video on Chinese New Year, February 10, but I didn't stick up to the date. Bruh. Still feels weird to use this, but I don't. Ox. All right, let's do this. I'm going to draw a pill from Teapot, but with a twist. She's going to be wearing an adorable ox costume. It's about to get freakishly whore in here. Aw, she's so cute and fluffy. I ain't hugging no psychopath. <laughs> if this calls for psychopathic behavior, vote for a pillow if you wanted to. Come on, man. Yeah, that. No way. Already, we are now going to draw the second character, which is Donut on a monkey costume, which is weird. Well, speaking of Donut, Donut Gamer! Oh, hell no, man. Oh, oh my god, it's already turned up not to be that bad, I mean, yeah. Ta-da! Look at my masterpiece. <laughs> Okay, quick honest opinion, it looks pretty dope. The yellow and the pink colors really popped off. Which you guys would go bananas if you see this guy shows up in your backyard one day. If you like cross between awesomeness and pure silliness, vote Donut. Eh? Eh? Oh, Gady. What is the nine? What are we getting, boys? Goat? Rooster? Uh, Rooster? Okay, we're getting Rooster. Okay, for this one, I have to draw Gady, you know, zigzags and stuff. Uh, ignore that. <laughs> the corner. For the character concept, there's this one thing that came to my mind. And there was this one YouTuber, Grant Weisler. Like, damn those bloody Americans! Like, actually, you should watch these videos. They're actually funny, actually. And when I think about it, like, maybe. Just maybe. Yeah, just maybe. I'll show you later. A little smile. <laughs> and in this part, let's maybe give this a color. Okay, shadowing stuff. Look at that mad fella. If you like drinking water, well, maybe you should vote for Gady. She got that OG Angry Bird rip though. Let's roll up, y'all. There's still a freakishly ton in here. I wonder how long the seasonal series ends, actually. Snowball. Okay, what do we get for a snowball guy? Dog. Okay. Dog. Okay, first, uh, I'm just gonna draw like a big round shape for his body. Just like Snowball. Uh, and then add those uh, pointy ears on top. Maybe I prefer a uh, curve over here. Yeah, that's bad. Like, yeah, like that. But instead of regular ears, they'll be cute little floppy dog ears. Hmm. 
To finish it all off, I'll add some color. Object shows gives you rabies. Object shows gives. Okay, I honestly like this thing. <laughs> this cute little fella. This is honestly like a me material or something. You know what I mean? If you like cute fluffy characters, then maybe you can vote for Snowball. <laughs> Giving this a fist spin, shall we? Oh, come on. Oh, Fanny, Gracie, I see Marker Nickel. Oh, Pen? Oh, wait, have I rolled Pen yet? Wait, wait. Editor's note, I haven't rolled pen yet. Come on, why am I lagging a bit? Okay, come on, something. No curse of fraud! That's just plain easy, man. Remember, there are no boundaries when it comes to art. Even if you're dressed as a rat, I mean, yeah, it's everything is experimental and stuff. And at the end, do I learn something? Yeah, so the whole point is that you just gotta let your imagination run wild. And that's the whole point. Okay guys, so I wanted to see a combination of teapot and a rat costume. And it turned our creative it into something legit lobotomy. I mean, just take a look. Bro looking like a Chuck E. Cheese straight from the hood, bro. No way. If you wanna vote, well, go ahead. He's currently best friends with Lucky Racer, Snowball, and presumably Funny, and is able to make it into the merchant season 1. What do you think I got this far? It was the 4th eliminated into 50 merchants. Are we getting juicy this time? I don't know. No freaking way! We just went like bosh, boom, and then we just got marker. Again. Wait, let's proceed to the costume. See, let's see. Is this website telling me something? It's like, is there like a message something he's trying to convince me? <laughs> what? <laughs> Yo. Just look at him. Bro's rocking that goat style. I suppose who knew I just drew him the second time, cause Last time, I drew him with a vampire costume, if you remembered. Yeah. Okay, Marco actually made a stunning look. So we got the horn, the shoulder fur, and the iconic X face over here. Yeah, this is a mustache. If you wanted a fuzzy art companion, Marco from Teapot has got you covered, even while wearing a goat costume. Okay, you don't want to miss this because I have something planned for you guys. So we have to roll the character. Okay, we got remote. The remaining tiny zodiacs animals left on the wheel are dragon, rabbit, tiger, pig, horse, and snake. Now let's see what it is. Boss. This is remote. Bye. And if she doesn't get the dragon costume, she'll jump off this cliff. Cause that's what y'all wanted to see. Just kidding, nobody wants to see this. Oh my god. Yep, yep, 2024 in my year, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, like, honestly, if we rolled onto dragon, that would be cool, but a horse? Come on, man. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, it's Jover. Uh... And this is what remote look like on a horse costume. If you don't want to see your remote trying to jump off a cliff again, it's up to you to save her. And that's all the seven teapot contestants I drew in this lunarish Chinese New Year. And it's up to you to vote to save one of the seven contestants in the image shown above. Don't forget the letter in the square brackets. Adios. Wait, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. I forgot.